Men of winter, my brother may be ill of mind, but his spirit and the spirit of winter lives on us all. Let's go and show those southerners what happens to outsiders when they foolishly venture where they are not welcome. Blood will be spilled on this day, but dragon blood will fill our mugs before winter's end. So follow me, men. Follow me into battle. For gods favor us. And thus begins part 24 of our House Stark playthrough. Now we have uh, a little bit of chaos for in, in store for us today. We go ahead and click on this. The entirety of Westeros is pretty much at war right now. Of course, it's more like House Stark versus House Targaryen once more, uh, as well as the Lannisters. And is that House... What house is this? House Crake Hall also helping us. Uh, can we win the war? I hope so. Right now, we're trying to rally them. It, it, it doesn't look promising when we go down there, does it? <laughs> right now, we're raising the rest of our men, and I think this includes our men at arms. So let's go ahead and wait for these guys to be raised. That's going to take four months, and then we march south. What's this? Oh, we're in a liberty war as well. That's with the, the, the rock, of course. Uh, we, we can't help them. We have bigger priorities. Our entire kingdom is at stake. What's under siege? Wait, King Aaron, the king... King Aaron is here? Oh, where is Grey Crown exactly? Okay, that's right here. No. No, yeah, that is Grey Crown. Okay, so we can attack here and maybe get the king or even kill him. Maybe, maybe we still have a chance. Right, let's go back up to our men. They are being raised ever so slowly. It's going to take another three months, but we, we do need everyone. I'm going to raise absolutely everyone. We can't take any risks. And i got to hope that this army down in the south doesn't march north and reinforce. Uh, what's all of this stuff? You've become my lord. My lord and vassal. What's a lord? Is that... Have they changed? Have I... Uh not understood this my lord oh it's my learning okay that's fine you're good at learning anyway so we'll keep that we can transfer a vassal let's go ahead and do this we'll, we'll keep everyone nice and organized the last thing i want now is some factions rising up to uh, attack me as well that would be absolutely terrible but though it might like it's going to happen don't we have some factions yeah liberty faction in one month oh dear Luckily, we can lower crown authority, though. We, we do have that reserved in our back pocket. Look at that. We're already heavily in debt. Oh, this is... And we're on organized army, even. Betrothed can marry. Who's this? Finn Stark, my brother, is going to marry the Boltons. Let's send off that one. Unfortunately, I don't think they can join us in this war, which is rather unfortunate. Uh, I could do with all of my vassals joining us. Right. Who's this? Zero soldiers. That's fine. Oh, that, was a, that wasn't a new ally joining anyway. We, all of the men are raised. Who do we want leading these men? You have 31 commander advantage. You're a forder and a reaver. Right, let's go ahead and put you in command of this army then. That has all of our men at arms. And then who's commanding this one? 26, but you're a logistician. Uh, whatever that word is. <laughs> <laughs> right, so I probably want this guy to go into first battle first because he does have the higher commander advantage. And I think it's time we march south. We're not going to get any more allies, are we? No, you're, you're not betrothed, though. You are. Could we get one more ally? Something tells me probably not. Yeah, that's all in the reach. I think we need someone from the Westerlands. Yeah, we already have you guys as an ally. Did uh, I might have skipped past a couple here. Can I... Can we not just type in Westerman? I think we can, yeah. Culture Westerman. Uh, and then let's go all the way back to the top. We already have the Lannisters as an ally. What about these guys? 2,000 men. I don't think it's going to make much of a difference. It is a fair few... They got bloody balusters. They got a unique unit. She's 13, though. I think we have to do it, right? Well, we need the allies. We desperately need allies. I think I'm going to marry you off. Prince Gareth of Winter, you're going to marry Malera Peckledon, or at least be betrothed, uh, so we can call them to the war. Let's wait for that one to go through, and then we can call them to the war. There we go. Alliance formed there. Uh, I should be able to call her to the war now. Yes. Uh, please bring your 2,000 men. Shall we wait for them to arrive? I feel like the longer we wait, the more likely these guys are to march north, though. 
So maybe it's not smart to march north. Uh, we should start marching south even. Let's start making our way down through our lands. Uh, and we're going to try and attack the king. Luckily the war target, we just need to hold on to our lands. And we can hold on to all of our lands. Uh, war school will go in our favour. Of course I should join you in this war. I first shall learn to fear the men of Greybrox. Excellent stuff. Oh, I'm so nervous. Oh, okay. Movement is happening. Not down here though. So they sense us coming. We could go down to Moat Kaling. In fact, let's go west of Moat Kaling. Otherwise, we're going to take attrition, aren't we? Uh, because that's enemy lands. Yeah, you guys stay down there. Okay. I think we're, we're good to go. What army? This is the army with the men at arms. Right, if you guys wait there and you guys come in behind. We need to be a bit more tactical about this. Let's go down to three times speed. I don't want to mess this up. If I mess this up, we could be in for a very bad day. Now, if we attack them here, that's probably not going to be a good idea, is it? Probably not. Can we go round this way, maybe? My allies are going through enemy territory. If we can just catch a part of their force off guard, uh, we might be able to kill a few thousand of them, and that could sway the battle. Let's just scout south. They're still not coming from the south, right? I, I have... No, they're all going to wait on Milk Kaling. Of course they are. Maybe we can catch this force off guard, though. It's, it's very possible we could do that. Let's try it. I, th I think I've messed up my opportunity there. Uh, we'll, we'll have to see. Let's go ahead and give this one away. We don't want to hold any of these lands north of the wall. Uh, and we'll go straight back to our army. This is the one with men at arms, yes. It is faction and... Okay, the peasants have disbanded. That's good. Because I think that was the dangerous faction as well. As my men and I trudge through one of the thousand swamps in the neck, we warily enter a dense thicket. All around us are fallen logs, enormous trees, twisted vines, and ferns that dwarf men. We cannot see through to the other side. As we slowly progress down the path, one of the forward men shouts back, I think someone's here. I stomp onward through the water, only to see the men ahead of me fall to the ground, arrows lodged through their torsos. I call my remaining men into defensive positions around me as what appears to be an army of Krangerman approaches through the woods. Oh, we're being ambushed now as well. Oh, crap. Right, we're both having to deal with this. Right, let's reinforce. We should be able to destroy them uh, very quickly. The Targaryens are going down here to reinforce this. There we go. We've won this battle. Let's just enforce the demands. We get a little bit of gold. We lost 100 men. It's okay. We, we should be fine. We didn't want to lose too much, though, did we? Is this where we're going to fight the Targaryens? I think it is. I think it is. The chances are even. They have armies in the south. I don't think these armies are coming north. If we could kill the king in this battle or even capture him, that could be huge. I never expected I would grow as close to Lord Commander Raymond as I have done in the past few years. On multiple occasions, he has proven himself to be a reliable and forthright man with only my best interests at heart. Ah, oh, it, it's so rare to find a true friend. Would the wall like to join my war? <gasps> oh, aren't we allies? We were at one stage. We're not anymore. No, we're not allies anymore. Ah, that would have been... Oh, it would be cool if they had um, unique men at arms as well for the wall. Like rangers and stuff. I'm not sure if they have those or not. Um, but that would be cool one day. It would be awesome if we could have invited them to the war, but it's not going to happen. Oh, my allies have been ambushed, but it's too late. We're going in to fight the Targaryens. <laughs> Follow me, men. Let's take the head off of the dragon. Okay, they dodged us. Right, if they go south, they're just going to unite with their, their allies, which is problematic. We could just siege back this land here. That would fix our war score. Why don't we then? Let's go ahead and siege this back. Uh, and then this army here, we'll, we'll go ahead and siege that one back as well. Supplies are also an issue. No, we still have, we're, we're still well supplied. It's all good. It's all good. Yeah, you guys are going to reunite. We we, mess, we missed our chance. 16,000 men there. They're taking attrition as well, though. Oh, they've been caught in another battle. But my allies are in the north. They're not going to join us. I arrived back at my castle after a long, lonely walk. Another year passed, another year older. Wait, a birthday party? In the middle of a war? Oh, wow. Um, do you know what? I'll take the medium-sized one. I have a book. Can we destroy that book for a little bit of gold? 
We can't because it's a court artifact even. Right, let's go ahead and put that one on display. I'm wondering, <laughs> we have a Fen banner? <laughs> we can't be displaying a, a Fen dynasty banner in my hall. Let's go ahead and put that on display. I wonder if we take a loan from the Iron Bank. Because if I'm in debt, I'm going to be getting a big negative modifier. Yeah, and they have 1,100 gold. They're not going into debt any soon, time soon. But they are taking a fair few casualties from attrition. Right, where's our, where's our men? Over here. How long would this take? 42 days. That's not too shabby at all. I think these guys are going to be useless at siege because it's just levies. So what I should do is rather keep them out of this. Just keep them nearby as reinforcements, most likely. The Targaryens... Are over here now. They are all taking heavy attrition. That's good for us. Let's let them... Let, yeah, they don't know the north as we do. Let's let them mess up a little bit. And I'll take full advantage of that. Uh, I'm okay with this. Right, we took this settlement back. Let's go ahead and take this one as well. I'll probably need to take some people out of this army. Uh, and this one's taken way too many casualties as well. So I probably need to move one of you out over here. In fact, we need to probably go to nearby castles even. Uh, in order to stop taking all this attrition. Let's go over here. Uh, and I'll send you guys, I don't know, over here. Why not? Hopefully that, that solves all of the supply issues. I'm not sure if it will. I, I, I hope so. It's not very well built up around here because it's all marshes uh, and bogs. 15%. Wasn't that 18% earlier? I think we are claiming back a, just a tad, just a smidgen of war score. Right. Are you guys... They're the enemies from the south. So this is the full Targaryen force up here now, I believe. Which could be very dangerous. Yeah, we're still losing supplies as well. I don't want to fight them at Moat Kaelin because they're going to get huge defensive bonuses, I think. Yeah, there we go. So we've managed to take this back as well. Can I take all the levies away from this army? Because we're, we're losing so much supplies. I shouldn't have pressed split in half. Um, you guys merge again. Split off a new army. What I just want to do is just get some of these levies out of here, really. If we can take this down to about, I don't know, 10,000, there we go. Uh, and that should be fine. We need a new commander as well. Does everyone have a commander? They do. Second army of Winterfell has our men at arms. Right, you go ahead and siege this then. This is all a very, very messy situation. We could get them in an attack. How's the numbers? They're down to 94,000. We're still heavily outnumbered though. Maybe that's not the best thing to do. I think the best thing to do is just to take back some of these take back some of these castles that we've lost to sieges uh, and then l keep letting them take attrition because they're running out of supplies as well although we our supplies are lower we might have to go back north actually we'll take this back first because at least then we get some war score out of it oh this is all look at that do we take a loan from the iron bank as well we're heavily in debt it's, it's all very problematic. This is a very long siege as well. We're, we're even taking attrition here now. Right. I need to split the armies. We, we, we can't keep living like this. Let's go ahead and take you over there. Uh, you need to split again as well. Let's go ahead and move some up there. Uh, we need we need to fix all of this. We can't be taking attrition like the Targaryens are. Yeah, 90,000. They are still very, very, very strong. Yeah, you guys are taking attrition, so let's go ahead uh, and move one of you, I don't know, up here. Is that safe? No idea. We're, we're still losing supplies. <laughs> oh, we're going to have to march north again soon. And we're taking we're taking heavy casualties here as well. Uh, it's, it's just not a good area to fight in at all, is it? Yeah, look, it's beyond terrible. What I could do... No, I need to keep them nearby. Maybe send you guys up here. I think you need to split as well and send you up here. They're losing supplies, but at least they're not dying yet. I think the Targaryens are coming for us as well. Right, you guys. Should we all just, like, gather here or something? I think we're going to have to fight. 
Uh, it looks like they're coming for us. In fact, I think we're in a, a very, very crappy situation here. Uh, we're, we're going to fight here. We have no choice. No idea who the commander is. We have a fair few commanders here, though. Apart from you, you're not very good. 16 battle advantage. I guess we can pick you 20 battle advantage. Right, men. Follow me once more. It's time to spill some dragon blood. <laughs> My allies up here have been trying to siege this for the longest time. The Battle of Bottom Bridge has begun. And it's the Targaryen King himself leading his men. Oh dear. Oh, 57,000 of them have been caught. Uh, slacking there. So if, if they get 69,000. Whoa, they have a lot of numbers. Wait, did we just capture... Who did we just capture? Or did they capture one of ours? I think they might have captured one of ours. Oh, we're, we're, we're so screwed, guys. 80,000 enemies. How? We're not going to win this, surely. Your counselor Mikon died. He was slain in battle. Oh, no. I need a new, I need a new chancellor. Let's quickly appoint one of those. Uh, Lord Robert. There we go. You can take your chancellor position back. Oh, this is terrible. Oh, it, it, it's, it's somewhat even. Oh, we're swaying it. What happened there? Okay, nothing. Nothing specific. Can we win this? Oh, this is terribly... Oh, I'm so nervous. Come on, men. Come on, rally on me. Let's kill these Targaryen scum. Uh, secret truth has reached the light of day. My vassal chieftain Oral's committed sodomy. We don't care about that. We're in the middle of a bloody fight. King Aaron was imprisoned or did he imprison one of my courtiers? I think he imprisoned one of mine. Yeah, he's not imprisoned, you see. He's still there. Oh, crap. What's this? Uh, I'm ill as well. Uh, king or peasant, high or low, it does not matter. In the end, we are all mortals. I was reminded of this as I woke coughing in the early morning hours. A dull ache pounding from my head and throat. You seem to be under the weather, my lord. Just do what... No, don't, don't do anything unnecessary. Last thing I need now is a chaotic succession. We have way more captains. And we have battle advantage. We might win this, dare I say. <laughs> I'm so excited. Quell presented me with a charred carcass of a cat and prompted me to dig in. As I ate, he told me how he had chased the plump feline around my holdings for hours. I think he wanted praise for his hard work, but the vile taste of the meal kept me silent. In the end, the fatty food turned out to be just what I needed, though. Excellent work, Quell. Right, back to the battle. Our captain, Lord Arthur, was wounded by Damien Targaryen. Oh, the Targaryens are quite a high prowess family. I think the odds are coming in our favor. It depends who's coming. What's this? Oh, they do have another 400 odd um, men at arms coming here, though. That could sway the advantage in their favor. We discovered a spy. Oh, no. We've, we've built some stuff as well. Samwell willingly exposed who is spying on you. Samwell is my captain at the moment, and he's very strong. Oh, no. I will be merciful, but only because I need you in this current battle. <laughs> oh, I really hope these other 400 crossbowmen that are coming don't uh, sway the battle in their favor too much. Come on, lads. We just need to kill one or two and we can win this. Oh, it's, it's trying. This is a long battle. I like this. Successor for the champion of the faceless gods, which means one of my acclaimed knights probably died in this battle as well. The numbers are getting closer. We're only outnumbered by 14,000 now. What's this? A learning perk. I probably don't want to get more health if I'm not very... I, I mean, I'm incapable Right, increased development, a uh, different culture opinion. That's probably actually very useful um, because we are trying to unite with the wildlings and there's a lot of cultures in our realm right now. 14,000 different. Regent fails to skim from mandate. Oh, it, it, it's getting closer. Liberty demand. Oh, crap. No, I, I will lower I will lower crown authority. The last thing we now need is a liberty war in the middle of this war. My spy master has come to me with grave news, or I do not yet know who. Someone is plotting against my courtier. Oh, crap. So much stuff. What's this? A dissolution faction? Not now. Oh, what the? Oh, crap. It's fine. We're going to win this battle. I can feel it in my bones. The old gods favor us on this day, men. Dorn Fickoth has joined my court. Are you a good fighter? You are. Uh, you're a black brother, though. I'm not quite sure how you've managed to join my court. 
That's very interesting. What's the different in men that? It's growing closer. Our captain was slain by Merrick. Uh, Merrick also died in the battle. Our captain was maimed by Lord Harmond. He's been imprisoned as well. Lord Roberts died in my dungeons. Lord Samuel was maimed. Okay, we read that one. As I woke this morning and observed of the first rays of sunshine, it took me a moment to realize I had slept soundly for the first time in weeks. I am glad to be well again. Was wounded. They're wounding so many of us. Oh, and we lost another captain. Uh, I need to give this to a riverman noble. Yeah, let's let's go ahead and do that. I've inherited this as well. No, I haven't. I've given it away. Uh, yeah, we're, we're, we're all okay here. <laughs> oh, this is taking... Peasants have disbanded again. Okay. The dissolution factions are scary. On. There's only a 4,000 difference now. Can we win this? This guy here, High Chief Borok, you have served as a mighty commander today. I'm gonna have to... What's this? I think he might have been raided recently or something. I don't know. But if we win this battle, I have to reward him. What a truly fine commander. Look at him. 60 years of age as well. He's waited his whole life for this one moment. And he's proving himself to the old gods right now. My counselor died because he was slain in battle. So many powerful people are dying in this one. Oh, I love it. No, I'm, not, I'm not trying to click on you. I'm trying to assign a new admiral. Uh, Lord Wayne of the Reels. There we go. I believe it was your father who just died as well. Oh, the numbers are even. Is this it? Are we going to win? Defeat. Oh, no, that's the Liberty War. Okay. <laughs> what do you mean, defeat? Our captain was slain by Lord Osnick. We've lost so many captains. They have superior quality to us, but we're killing them. They're just simply running out of numbers. Our oh, Captain Lord Robert was wounded. Uh, Damien Targaryen, you are... You are pulling your weight in this battle for the enemy. <gasps> We're gonna win! Please capture the king. Please capture the king. I don't think we managed to capture the king. What's this? The Battle of Bottom Bridge ending in an astounding victory. I eagerly listen to the messenger as he reads the report from my commander, High Chief Dembork. And then turns to the soldiers before me. My lord! We came upon the enemy banner while we were cleaning the battlefield. We thought it would be a shame to leave it behind. Perhaps you wish to keep it as a trophy. <gasps> the Iron Throne War Banner? <laughs> burn it. <laughs> we could have used that for the stats. But I would rather burn it. Oh, we've been ambushed as well. So we have 49,000. Oh, we have to capitalize on this. Do we take Mult Kaelin or do we... If we march, we don't have supplies to march to Mult. We don't, yeah, we don't have the supplies to go to King's Landing right now. We lost 24,000, but we killed 40,000. Look at this. We killed so many of their champions. Actually, so many of... Oh. Oh, that was brutal. For both sides. The levies killed 21,000. Our captains killed nearly 5,000. Bloody Ballisters, 3,900. They definitely poured their weight in this one. Winter Wolves, 2,900. Although there were less of them. The bloody ballisters, eh? Uh, they, they, the outriders did good. We didn't even have many outriders. Oh, that's... Oh, that was wonderful. <laughs> that was a wonderful battle. Oh, and we have... Oh, that's total pursuit. Okay, right. Let's dismiss this. Uh, pause the game. We are winning this war. No, we're in another battle. Right, let's go ahead and end this battle then. I think we could go back to four times speed now. I just wanted to uh, really enjoy that battle. It was such a pivotal point in the series. And probably... I think... Isn't that the biggest battle we've had yet in terms of numbers? I can ransom you for 12 gold. I mean... We're minus 600. That 12 gold is not going to do much for us at all. Uh, we need to resupply as well. Which is rather a problem. It's quite a big problem. Do we go back and resupply? We're, we're going to be taking so many casualties. The problem is now the Targaryens will return and they will raise more men. If we don't re resupply, we're going to be heavily outnumbered once more. What I might do... Where, where the hell is my army? This one? Yes. You guys go ahead and siege this. And then everyone else... Is this... This... We might be able to resupply here. You go here. And then I'm going to send all of these other small armies. Like, we might be able to resupply here as well. 
Uh, there's a, a fair bit of supply here. I just realized if you hover it even tells you where you can get supply from. Right, let's go ahead and supply here. We, we have some supplies here. Some supplies here. Let's just spread out a little. And we have some supplies here. Let's just spread out. Resupply everyone. One of my armies is going to take this. How far will they retreat? Much further than this, I imagine. No. Only this far. We have to finish them off now. I think we attack them again. Who's this commander? <laughs> Borok? No, that's not Borok. Okay. This army's going to engage first. So I wonder. Lord Gavin, unyielding defender. You're going to command the second attack. Let's go in and attack them, my friends. We must finish off the Targaryens. In the dusty corner of the library, I find a tome bound in leather and inscribed with weird symbols, partially hidden behind other books. It is old, but has obviously seen some recent use. As I leaf through it, I quickly come to re the realization that it deals with some unconventional knowledge. Oh, interesting. Uh, we gain some learning. Let's go ahead and do that. Is it better for us to resupply, though? Yeah, they're having troubles. I think it might be better to resupply. Why? We should play. We're winning the war. We should play a bit smarter and a bit more defensive and passively. I think Chieftain Gaffin has been actively supporting Lord Fear and his dissolution faction. However, my wife has a plan to change that. Trust me, the things I could tell Chieftain Gavin would make him disavow Fear in an instant. Oh yeah, make sure he never supports him again, wife. Yeah, this dissolution faction is not good. And I don't have any anyone to marry. Are you unmarried? Yeah, they're, they're all married. Which is rather problematic. I could do... A, oh, I can't even have children anymore because I'm incapable. Ah, oh, crap. There's nothing I can do about this, right? This is going to end us. Can I gain more war score from battles won? No, because it caps at 50%. So it's the holdings we're going to have to... We're going to lose so many levies once this dissolution faction starts. Oh boy. Yeah, I've changed my mind. Let's go defensive because we're about to have another war. Let's meet up here. Uh, what, what house is this? This is House Dustin. Oh, okay, let's go ahead and meet up at the capital of House Dustin. Uh, and hopefully we can resupply. The Targaryens are coming again. What, what way are you going? No idea. My spy master has come to me with grave news. It is my vassal chieftain Raymond that is plotting against my courtier. Oh, the loathsome fiend. Oh, damn it. Yeah, you're going all the way through here for some reason. Aren't you going to take casualties? No, you're not. Okay. I trust the AI more than I trust me. Right, we're resupplying, lads. The second wave of battles will be fight. Yeah, they're trying to resupply desperately as well. Um, but they have much less land to do it. <laughs> the problem is we don't even have many castles over here, do we? <laughs> right, one of these armies we need to move. Right, let's move you over there then. We want to keep all the supplies nice and high. There we go. We're, we're still losing supplies. Let's go ahead and send someone over there. Uh, we can send someone over here. We need new commanders for all of these armies as well. Joran has returned. No idea where he went to. Oh, the Lannisters are over here. So how fast are they raising new men? Quite fast. Yeah, they already outnumber us. Uh, where are more castles? Over here. We shouldn't attack them, so that's fine. And I think I need to move one more army. I can move them over here. And that should be okay. And then everyone can resupply. Uh, and we're all living a happy life. Oh, the rock has come. <gasps> oh, because the Liberty War ended. Of course. Okay. Wait, you're losing supplies still. Right, let's move one of your armies then. Uh, and we'll simply send them over. <laughs> I'm running out of towns. Over here. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. <laughs> this is terrible. Oh dear. Uh, these guys have a, a much worse problem of it as well. They are losing supplies again, look. I wonder. 66,000, 65,000. There's no point attacking them though, is there? Because uh, we can't get more war school from victories. Demand artifact? No. It's mine. 
So we're just going to wait a little bit. Let's get all these supplies back up. That's the plan. And then we will try and siege. Maybe Milt Kalin we go for. Neighboring ruler won a war. How many wars are you in? Oh, do you know what it is? They keep being ambushed. That's what's happening there. Now we could go down and attack them. 72,000. They are very disorganized right now. But I, 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 like I said, I don't think we're going to gain any, any advantage from doing that. The good thing here is they can't raise more men now. Do we go for... Oh, Regent is now more powerful. That's something... Oh, and the dissolution faction has come. To my liege, it is time for you to recognize that you are not able to maintain the unity of winter. It's time to end your rule or of any others. The region needs freedom. Accept our demands or face our swords on the battlefield. Oh, no. I will not be threatened. Only 14,000. We How many levies did we lose? Only 2,500. Do you know what? We might be okay. The problem is, though, it's the Targaryens. We don't want them to catch us off guard. Right. I need to call on allies. All of my allies, join me in this dissolution war, please. Let's go ahead and stamp this out yeah, as fast as we can. In fact, if we go over to White Harbor, we might be able to do that. It's only over here. Is that our war target? I don't think we... We have a war target, do we? No. Oh, it's mostly wildlings that join. That's why they're so weak. So the actual northern lords like us, it's the wildlings. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, we we can defend against this. The wildlings are going to be bloody useless at siege. Where's my strong army? They have 7,000. This has all my men-at-arms and siege equipment. If I just march over here with this army, we're going to take attrition, though. 100, that's fine. If I just go east with this army, my allies should follow me and we should be able to take out their capital. Uh, all my allies are going to join this war as well, which is bloody marvellous. There we go. We should be able to end this. I also noticed you can join me in this war, so I'm going to ask you to join. Any number of men is an advantage. Demand artifact. That's my cousin. You want the prize necklace? No. It's mine. I'm going to decline that. We're minus 800 gold in the hole as well. Oh, crap. It's still far from a winning situation. And my friend just died as well of old age. Right, I think that's a good place to leave things. Because we've been recording 30 minutes. In the next one, we're going to attack White Harbour. And hopefully end this dissolution faction rather fast. Uh, and then we need to focus on the Targaryens once more. The good things about this war, I think we just have to take back any any castles they siege and the war score should tick up in our favor and we have the 50 percent here yeah okay so as as long as we keep winning this one i'm more than happy with this and it's not like they can get any allies either because it's only me and the rock they can ally and the rock already joined us in this war right that's it for this one guys hopefully you enjoyed today's episode right now <laughs> all of restaurants is very much in war uh, so the next one is probably going to be a fun one as well but thank you for watching as always and i'll see you next time